Hey guys, today I'm in the greenhouse and I'm going to be um, putting some seeds in some seed starter trays. And we're using the seed starter tray from Haas Tools and we're also using the premium seed starter mix that they, pro mix that they sell. Danny's having really good luck with his tomatoes and peppers, so I'm fixing to start some herbs. I'm finishing it up. I just run my hand over and fill in these little pockets. And we'll put a little more dirt on there to finish in those. And if you just kind of push it, it just falls right in. These trays are so great because they're heavy duty trays. And when you do this, you're not worried about um, them moving, bending, whatever. You can just put your dirt there and push it in the holes. Okay, so we've got it pretty close to being full. And that's what it's going to look like. And you just run your hands over it, smooth it out. And we're going to put our seeds in this. I've got a variety of seeds. Okay, so I'm going to plant a couple of rows of purple basil and the Italian basil because we like the green and the purple. And this is going to go in with our tomatoes. So I'm going to do like a couple of rows each of those. Then I'm going to get my marker so I know what's what. I'm going to have dill and cilantro, like one row of each. Skull cap, bee balm, this is fenugreek, comfrey, lemon balm, wormwood, uh, this one, thyme, okay, I see thyme, and parsley. So these are the seeds I'm going to start, and I'm just going to put one in each one, if I can help it, and then we're going to set them in the mini greenhouse. And we're going to lightly wa mist water over them. And we'll do that every day and see if they don't come up. The markers I'm going to be using, two of them are from Hoss Tools. I'm going to be doing the purple basil and the Italian basil on the Hoss Tools. I'm going to do them on each end. And then all the little things here, I'm putting um, all these little seeds that I'm only doing like one row. I'm going to use these little... Um, markers that Red Duchess Farm sent and they come in really handy. They're small, compact. They use them in their greenhouse. Some of these things are from Haas Tools like the parsley and this basil and I think that's it. Nope, I got another one here. The dill and the cilantro. I'm using Haas Tools tray, Haas Tools starter and their little seed markers. So guys, we have a link in the description below for Hoss Tools. Check it out. All these things are there, guys. Awesome. I'm going to be laying my tray out. The first two rows are going to be the purple basil. The next row will be, the third row is going to be the dill. And the fourth row is going to be the parsley. On this side, the first two rows will be the Italian basil, and the third row will be the cilantro. Then as I work my way in, I'll place my tags for each row of what I'm doing for the other smaller herbs. I have all my seeds in the tray. I've got them all labeled. I was minus one here, so I put catnip on this side, borage here. So I know what it is, but everything is in there. I've watered it. You can see the water dripping through. And it says to just come through and lightly mist them every day. So Danny's tomatoes have done great with the Haas tool system. We're going to see if my uh, herbs will do great. And I know I've got a little crazy with some of the herbs. There are different types. But these are some of them I don't grow here yet. And we're trying to get them started. Some of them are just some that we use every year. So, this is what it's looking like with my potted 
herb seeds. I had to get down because the wind's starting to blow and it's fixing to start getting cool. I'm going to have to let the door down on my greenhouse, but this is my mini greenhouse, as you can see. It's been doing great, and my seeds, we're going to see 12 to 18 days. Let's see if they come up. Let's see the germination rate. And for the seed tray, I'm really pleased. I love this seed tray house tools. So if you guys want one like this that you can use over and over years on end, check the description below for house tools. Thank you guys from Crazy Days.